testing this out i've got a toroid coming i really kind of need to tune it with that on there but supposedly that whatever you want to call it top load is uh should have it running fairly similar that little tiny output is running at about uh you know 240 kilohertz something like that right and as soon as i bring the voltage up just a hair it uh jumps up to 340 uh, seven or something like that, right? So that's the feedback that I'm currently running And uh, that's just how it goes. So likewise, I can adjust the center frequency down here Just like a tiny little freaking smidget and it's gonna jump down to about uh, 250 or so not totally sure how I sh you know should go about the tuning there when I think about it either way I really don't want to ditch the PLL because I kind of want that strong feedback uh, at all times all right, so I'm gonna try to crank this up a little bit. Just kind of show the uh, the ramp waveform also. So let me see. Right now, that's about 75, right? So that's not quite what I was getting at 75 uh, VAC on the last setup. Secondary feedback. And this is what the uh, ramp looks like. So I almost want to say the ramp runs even better on the dual resonant coil here it's, it seems even cleaner let me get my dang measurements back here so about 82 volts right there so basically again just another thing to note the, the way this uh little inverter works and the setup i've got i'm at 75 vac on the variac got about 80 vdc out on the ramp right so that's just how that is and on time you can see about 10 milliseconds or, you know 8 to 10 let's just say it's about 8 more like so bring it to 100 you can see it's actually still still pretty clean there about 110 something like that it's all right, you know, let's just say if this was my first go, I'd be like, all right, cool, cool, cool. But now I'm trying to beat what I had before with the dual resonance setup. So, let me see. So right there, my uh, OCD kicked in. So let me put the OCD up just a smidgen more. So that's 120 VAC. And that's about 130 volt ramp or so. So if I up the on time just a little bit, it's probably going to sag that down. Yeah, so again, if I up the on time slightly, it sort of tames the uh, swords a little bit. That looks looks fairly tame right there compared to uh, the lower on time, right? So, two, four, six, eight. So, closer to 10 milliseconds at least, I feel like that's what that thing likes. So, my OCD is still kicking in. Let me bring it back up a smidgen more. So yeah, OCD is still kind of kicking in there. I don't really want to keep playing with it blind. Um, but what I can try to do is leave it there and see how fast I can get the VPS with this setup. That's a little battery too, so... It, it's a uh, smaller drill battery than normal. See that voltage kind of. Yeah, so it starts sagging down too much. But that's. I can actually do that with the bigger battery.
<laughs> OCD. It's looking like, you know, I can max out two feet. Well, actually, I don't know. Let me see. Well, what is that? Okay. Yeah, I can definitely get two feet off that. I'm just going to raise the OCD a slight other <laughs> extra hair there. Hopefully it don't blow up now. Okay. So OCD still wants to kick in. It's kind of looking like maybe in this setup, I just do need to bring the voltage up a lot more. 